I do love the taste of poom poom. And Thornton's. <laughs> that Thornton's. Poom poom. Me do love the taste of the poom poom juice. <laughs> what the fuck? It's like a battery, doesn't it? What happened it in the interval? Like a battery. Battery. A kind of a battery. I do yeah. love the taste of it until I've come. And then I'm like, oh, that'll blah. Do you know what I mean? There I- you go. That's literally <laughs> the visual embodiment what? of what my brain does four times a podcast. Do you mean, should you go back down there? You mean? <laughs> no, no. So like, right, let's- Oh, I get, yeah, you finished and it's not sex anymore. Yeah. Yeah. So like, like while I'm down there, I'm like, oh, let's boss this. And then the second <laughs> I'm finished and you can still smell it on your muzzy, you're like, ugh, audible. <laughs> <laughs> the pum pum. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Just oh, like a battery, <laughs> no, I, I love it all the time. This is how he fa- failed his second test. <laughs> oh, it's this. No, I mean, no. You know what I mean. You agree with me because you you know what I mean, and you wouldn't know what I mean if you didn't agree Isn't with me. Isn't it just like when you come and then exactly you hate porn? Exactly. Yeah. yeah, when you have to put your phone in a different room because you're yeah. like, I need to not look at that for a day and a half. <laughs> Stop yeah. watching porn now. Just have you? Thinking. Why? I saw, I saw another podcast where they mentioned it, so I've gone, <laughs> I've gone a week now. No, what? not November. Yeah. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. What'd you do? How long? See, clearly now. <laughs> do you say it's been a week? Yeah. So you stopped a week ago? Yeah. Do you do you think this is going to be a long term thing or? I'm going to aim, aim for it to be. What? Um, so you, you'll productive. probably be able to aim. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> at the fucking wall. It trickles out. Well, um. <laughs> um <laughs> It's sometimes I'm thinking of the bullshit to say, and I feel like Stephen just gets a little jab and you're like, oh God, I'm trying to concentrate and you're making me laugh. Uh, but I don't, what do you, I don't, what brought it on the need to just, surely you didn't watch one YouTube and be like, I'm done with porn. Has this been something in your head? Because honestly, I'm, I'm worried because I'm about to turn 40 next year yeah. and I, I am an enthusiast. Yeah. And I wonder how far that's going to, I just don't want to be a 70 year old like, Mari! <laughs> In the old people's home, like, 85. Let the bloody broadband's gone off. I bet it has your dirty butt. I'm worried that I can't yeah. be doing it forever. What brought it on, the, the need for change? I don't know. I just think that, um, I guess, like, people say it's bad for you. Do you know, watching porn? Or maybe it changes your perception of Yeah. Pum pum juice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, sometimes I'm in a room surrounded by women and I'm like, why, why is no one sucking me off? Yeah. Like, every film I've watched recently, the man walks in the room and gets noshed off. Why isn't that? I know it's Asda and that, but why? Yeah. I watch, yeah, sometimes when I have sex, I'm like, where are all the, the guys? <laughs> <laughs> this is boring, just me. Where are my homies? Have you ever tried VR porn? <laughs> with like your hat, not a hat on. I don't want to, your VR, with the, VR mate, headset, yeah. I don't, I've seen videos of people falling over doing VR. I don't want to fall over with my knob out. That's not a good look, is <laughs> Just it? Just sit down then. Discl- yeah. Dislocate your dick because you were like, oh, the fucking vaginas are See, everywhere. here's my worry with VR, right? Because, you know, like in porn, right? The, the thing will be happening there, but then someone might walk in from the side. <laughs> if you've got VR on, like, Headphones imagine- as well. You just see like a rogue dick just coming round the corner. I reckon that'd distract me. Do you know what I mean? Oh. So like I'd be looking like, oh, this is fucking great, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, massive dick. You know, like yeah, when yeah, yeah. you know, like when there's like a fly comes into your peripheral. Yeah. It'd be like that with dicks with the art, I think. But that, then also, because you've got that on. It's all right, because you but I think if you lived alone, it's fine. But if you if you've got roommates and you've got the VR headset and headphones, they could just knock on, walk in. And you'd be oblivious because my mate has one, yeah. and this is two other people, and one of them's recently moved out, and I reckon they've just walked in, seen him, you know, tugging away. Yeah, just gone, oh, fuck. You need privacy for VR. Yeah. But at least you'd, you if you ever been VR caught in a hostel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fact. <laughs> Fact. But at least with the VR, you're. I mean, it's not good for them. But at least you don't know you've been caught. That's true. Yeah. You're, you're so in the zone. There's big fucking whale dicks coming to, from right and left. But yeah. But like, it's worse just getting caught cracking one out when you're like, all right. Have you this been caught? It. Yeah. Who by? Uh, Danny Mac when we lived together in Chester. And oh. it, yeah. He just walked in. And I was it, like, I'd literally set up. I was in like my op- <laughs> in my office chair, <laughs> laptop. And he walked Sat in. He went, he went, oh, sorry. <laughs> and then went, I was like, well, I've got to face this one out. Did you went finish? downstairs and he's like buttering crumpets. And I'm like, all right, mate. He's like, yeah, not making eye contact. He was like, who are you Skyping? <laughs> I was like, I was like, I can't lie. I was like, I wasn't, I wasn't Skyping. I was, I was wanking. He went, I know, mate. <laughs> I know you were. 
He was just trying to give me the out of being like... Do we know like, embarrassed you must have been Skyping. about wanking? Because we all do it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, Some more than others. Should just be like... Stephen. You shouldn't even, like... Shouldn't even break... You shouldn't even break the stride, really. You should be like, what are you doing? Like, get out, I'm busy. Yeah. Knock! <laughs> did you finish, then? Yeah. Not immediately. <laughs> oh, Danny! <laughs> Hello, lad. He's a, hey! He's a good-looking lad. I didn't do Kevin Webster. <laughs> Hey, get out! <laughs> Not doing this for Sophie! <laughs> hey. Not doing this for now, is it? He can crowbar that into he's getting, anything. He's getting some fucking mileage out of this. <laughs> yeah. Best man speeches, fucking funerals. <laughs> Adam, could you say a few words? Hey! <laughs> I'm not doing a eulogy for Rosie! You're really bad at it. I am. I can do it. <sighs> you put a request in, didn't you, with Carl, for me to do an impression? Yeah. What was it? Robbie Williams feel. Was there any particular reason? Because you want to torture me? The problem is, is that I've, I've been watching this podcast a lot and now it's sort of taken over my life. So I'm just listening to a song and I'm like, I wonder if Adam could do this. Yeah. So you know the answer's no, don't you? When it, <laughs> it's a tough song, yeah. I just want to feel real love. <laughs> just bring it away. I got too much life running through my veins. Going away. I think my dick's just found that extra 5% <laughs> inwards. Uh, yeah, it's disappeared for the winter. <laughs>